Hey guys, so today I'm going to be showing you how to install mods to Minecraft Pocket Edition 0.11.x on Android. So the X stands for any version of 0.11 that is out, whether it be 0.11.0, 0.1, 0.2, 0.3, 0.4, 0.5, whatever. It will work with this tutorial, and currently I'm using 0.11.1 because as of this video, that is the latest version. So you're going to need three things. You're going to need Minecraft Pocket Edition, obviously. MCPE mod locator and block launcher both pro or free will work. It doesn't matter pro costs a dollar a dollar seventy two I believe on the Play Store and then you can also get the free version from the Play Store obviously for free MCPE mod locator the app that I make is no longer on the Play Store Unfortunately, thanks to Google's great system to scan for malicious apps and remove anything that should be removed um, It's very it's it's really flawed so that did remove my app because of how flawed it is and uh, there's really no chance of getting it back. And I've, after looking online, I've noticed that it really does remove more apps that are legit than it does malicious apps because the Play Store is really turning into a cesspool of malware. So, yeah. Anyways, to get MCPE Mod Locator, what you need to do is go to the link in the description, download that APK, and if you've installed them before, you know what to do. But if you haven't installed an APK before, you need to go to your settings, go to security, and where it says unknown sources and it, you know it's probably unchecked just tap on that check it click ok and you're ready to go then go to this go down to the to the description okay i'm tripping over myself and i had to slow down and repeat myself and that was weird um click on the link there and download that apk and there should be a notification uh that says you know download complete whatever uh, just click on that and it should prompt you to install. Hit the install button or it might say next, I don't know. Uh, but once it's finished installing, you'll have a little icon on your home screen or in your app drawer down here uh, for MCPE Mod Locator. So let's start there and open up that. Now, one thing to know about MCPE Mod Locator is since it is not on the Play Store anymore, you have to deal with updates like this. So it says an update is available, version 2.6.1 is out, update now. This is just a test basically to say, uh, you know, show you how it works. So click yes, use whatever browser you want, I'll just use Chrome. And then it says uh, there is a, oh this is already in my downloads folder, I'll just click replace file. It starts to download and then um, once it's finished, go to the uh, no, uh, the notification thing up there, the pull down menu, whatever, the drawer, and click on that and then install it again. I'm not gonna do that right now because it's not an actual update, it was just like a test basically. So anyways, let's go to mods. Go to 0.11.x and here you can see we have a very small list of current added mods. Yeah, I do want to improve on this. I want to get some new mods added to it, but I haven't had a whole lot of time. But hopefully today or tomorrow I can update this app with uh, some newer mods on it and a bigger list of mods because, yeah, there aren't a whole lot right now, especially compared to 0.10.x, which had a fairly good size list. I think it's like 45 or 50, uh, but here, not so much. So let's go ahead and just try one anyways. Uh, click on simple commands and it'll tell you just to, you know what the mod does basically so it says simple commands as all kinds of new commands to mcpe such as slash tp slash effects slash give and slash game mode use slash help to see all available commands click install and then this window here for block launcher opens up and then you can click import and now we're ready to go and sorry if you can hear that lawn mower in the background here we have block launcher so let's go ahead and open that up here at the top you can see we have a little wrench, click on that, click manage mod PE scripts, and now we're on this little thing here that I'll usually list every mod you have, but I only have simple commands right now. And to get this to work, you have to click the little switch in the top right corner. So switch that from off to on, and now we're ready to go. So click on simple commands, click enable, and now we'll go back, and I'm actually going to restart block launcher. Not that you have to do that, but I've just had so many problems with it today trying to get this video ready to go that that might get it to work and I'm actually not going to use that world I think it's actually a corrupted world and let's try using like slash game mode whoops slash game mode Ugh, I hate typing in landscape mode uh, survival and it says game mode changed to survival there we go that is how that command or that mod works I think another one was, uh, actually we can use slash help and see all of them. There you can see it shows a list of all of them. There's slash clear, slash effect, slash game mode, slash give, and slash heal. 
So yeah, that is how it works. I was gonna like jump off here and see if I can. There we go. Let's go ahead and try slash heal. There we go. Now I'm healed. Also, this is a permanent change too. So if I go back, go to quit to quit to title, let it freeze up for a little bit because that's what it does. See if I can just close out of it. Nope. It actually worked. And you can see it is switched to survival, even though it was originally creative. So yeah, that is how you use mods on Minecraft Pocket Edition 0.11.x on Android. I hope you all enjoyed this tutorial, and stay tuned to this channel for some more tutorials on textures, skins, maps, and so on. And hopefully, when I make a video about MCPE Mod Locator being back on the Play Store, hopefully I can do that if it ever gets back on. So... If you're not subscribed, I recommend hitting that subscribe button and you'll be notified every time I upload a new video. So I hope you all enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.